Okay. Hanging out to blog. Long story. Haven't been able to do anything for two days. I don't have a meeting at the beginning of the trading day. Stuff's up. You getting in the zone. Okay. We can go into that or we can talk about the market. It's pretty excited right at the minute. We've just had a really good move. Um, missed several opportunities as usual. What's new? Let's move some stuff here. Oh. Okay. Um, somebody just wants me on Skype. It's all good. Good news is better than bad news. Okay. So we've had a nice jump. It's early in the morning. Uh, well, as in... Um, really in the trading morning start it's actually 10 o'clock a.m. my time which is Gold Coast, Queensland um, we've had a nice jump here with the market which is just what we needed because we're going long which is a bit of a long story I should have been going short for the last two days anyway we're in profit now a little bit of profit there we're just waiting for these two to flick into profit I still have a hunch that it's going to come back now um, if we look at the ES, say for the last two days, um, well, it did come back overall. Let's look at the thing on go one day. Oh, that's not really showing me what I want to see, but anyway, let's talk about now. We've had a big move, so it's all good. USD dollars going down. I hate my mouse. Um, Aussie dollar looks like it's all over the shop, but. I mean, for the country, we want to keep it down anyways. Going down there, excuse me, and I say it's pretty jumpy, really. I'd call that fairly jumpy. I mean, what kind of trend would you call that? <laughs> I'd feel like you'd call that fairly choppy. Um, I think it's trying to stay down, but at the same time, it sort of seems to want to go up. There you go, choppy as all week. So a little bit hard to go by these um, the the Aussie dollar indicator, in fact, and. Also, the USD hasn't been performing very well for me as an indicator lately, so I'm a bit, a bit miffed about that, but I'm still keeping them uh, in, in my eyesight because you know I still believe that I want to know what, who, whatever, everything else is happening. Now, they're talking viciously about gold and how the Forex market's looking fragile, which we can see that. We can see that. It's you know fairly jumpy. I mean, even though that's probably trending down the USD, um, it's still probably pretty choppy, really. And um, we just discussed the Aussie dollar. So here's the um, gold, and it has been just rising. This is a weekly chart, hourly, hourly bars, nothing flash. Um, but you know, it's pretty simple to see what's been happening there. Can you see my cursor? Yes, you can. Good. Um, yeah. So it's pretty easy to see what's happening there. So. Let's just go um, for the two hour and see what's happening now. And it's just retrenching a little bit there, but gold is a lagging indicator, so I'm not placing all my bets there. Just like to sort of know what's going on with it, really, I guess. Bit of a sticky beaking. Now, it is Friday, and I only have one more week left in this country before I have to uh, vacate for a, a couple of weeks so one of my um, new strategy rules and especially at this time since I've been trading um, for many years and I am going to be brave and not even take a computer with me so I didn't think I need a bit of a pat on the back there anyway we'll see how we go I'm going to rely totally on my iPhone for communication and uh, for vlogging I will be vlogging off that um, because as I cannot take this little camera without a computer I won't be able to download anything but I'm going to download um, live videos from Bangkok and my travels um, and then I will be going on to Koh Samui so if anybody's interested in having a look at that they're more than welcome to not saying that I'm the best video in the world or um, not into selfies <laughs> but we'll see what we can come up with anyways I'm sure there'll be plenty of entertainment there um, just wanted to touch base because I haven't had a chance to um, accounts still looking reasonably okay um, would would have really liked to have got up to at least the 25 mark this week would have been nice we're at 23 and a half um, I'm making a new rule for myself until I get to making 10 grand which is 20, uh, 30 then I'm going to double my packages which will double our profit and that's real fun I love that 
that's real fun, making money. Not losing money. Um, I lost a good couple of opportunities over the last couple of days to pull in at least 1,200 bucks. Um, you know, I can use all the excuses in the world, but life gets in the way. That's all I can say. And if I could work out a way, which I know many people have, or even claim to, but if I could possibly work out a way that I could work with my strategy 24 hours, 5 days a week, um, without actually having to do it physically, because physically I think it's impossible with, um, let's keep an eye on these charts while I'm chatting to you guys, because I got nobody else here to talk to, other than my poor husband that's heard it all before, um, yeah, I still have this idea, so I really would love some feedback or some comments. If anybody's got any crazy ideas, I really don't care what they are. I've got no, 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 oh, how can I put it? <laughs> no morals? That's not the way to go. Um, so, anybody know anything about, I would like to definitely investigate robot trading. Um, as I just said to you, a lot of people have claimed and I know there are programs out there. I certainly don't have the time or the effort or the knowledge to do any homework or background. But if there's any geeks out there that want to help me out on that subject, feel free to leave comments, please. I'd love some feedback. Always check in my YouTube channel. Could be as boring as all hell for you, whoever. But I think um, they say in the YouTube world, if you don't like it, subscribe. If you like it, subscribe. So why don't you just subscribe? It's not going to hurt. Cost you nothing. Anyways, give me feedback. Feedback, man. It's always good. I will come back to you when there's a little bit more movement there. It's a little bit slow now. It's not much fun happening. Oh, the Aussie dollar's kicking up. So that's nice. And I'm glad to do this diary entry as I've missed, missed this little bit of... Um, how can I put it? Reflection or confession? Oh, I could get into that. Anyway, we won't go there. And I will be back. We'll load this now. And subscribe. Thank you. Bye.